journey with GBR clinic has been uh, a very long journey I would say. 2010, I have been associated with GBR. Uh, her clinic was placed somewhere at Mogapai West where she actually started at a very small scale and when I was just walking around finding out some doctor who could help me out in my problem I just came across this GBR clinic. I had absolutely no idea about infertility and uh, what does it mean, how is it going to help me but the only expectation I had in my mind is I had some concern that need to be addressed which is gynecology. Uh, I was not very comfortable with any of the gynecologists around. I felt um, the knowledge was very limited. You know, questions uh, they were not able to answer properly. So I was looking for a doctor who is very informative, um, very patient in answering my questions. So someone referred GBR clinic and that's how I came into the clinic. The moment I landed in the clinic and the moment I saw the doctor Bhuvneshri, I was so glad that I met her because the smile on her face and the confidence that she showed uh, in addressing every you know, question or the concern that I asked, that itself put me in a place that I was so confident that this is going to be the doctor, she is going to be the person who is going to give an answer to my Dr. Bhuvaneshri. I just spoke. I told her about my problem. And it was an immediate decision that the doctor took that I had to go in for a surgery. Usually when the end the doctor model or surgery and the first thought that comes is like first thing is like yes, fear surgery and every face panaporo other. Second thing is yes, the finance involved. And convincing answer despite the fact that going in for a surgery was very quick for me. I was not at all prepared. But she was so confident, she said, Kandipa Unglala handle Panamuryu and it will be good for you. Either Panle Nada, you will have a lot of side effects which is going to affect others. So no something I felt that Dr. Mela Rumba confidence which in our Rumba I was so scared about the surgery, I didn't want to go for it. It was ovary removal surgery. She said it's a laparoscopy, so nothing to worry. Anna, in always I had a fear about pain and surgery, after effects, I had so much in my mind, but the way she handled the whole thing, regular checkup concerns. Anytime I call her, she would pick up my call, she would talk to me. More than anything else, more than a doctor, she was a person who was very confident in approaching the patient's need. There was a lot of compassion that she had about us. Like now was simple or chinna she'll never get irritated or um, in a sort of being a gynecologist, she'll go through a lot of labor that she has to go through. Adha Tavra Kura Urunal Kura have not seen doctor who has lost her you know, cool or that is something that today I don't find in doctors. I would be very glad in sharing this that the success behind Dr. Bhuvneshri's growth is her compassion and the patience that she has towards every patient, every person whom she approaches. So, I had a feeling that I may not go in for a normal child, it's difficult because the chances of conceiving were very limited. So, she suggested going for IVF, uh, I think it was, yes, IVF. She asked me to come over and uh, I had a lot of expectations. I was so curious. Uh, almost two days, one phone bani, ini ki var nama, analik var nama, when is going to be this, when is going to be that. Rumba curious on area questions ke time, but aungga rumba poor me answer pananga. First time, I didn't get anything out of it. Second time, yes, yanak, it was a positive result. I felt that, yes, days have uh, passed and I was expecting that it would be a baby. But uh, actually, over 45 days could agla, by the time I came and I went in for a checkup, she said, no, uh, it's not a baby, it's about it. Uh, and the feel one day in a rumba, it, it really upset me a lot. The most vibrant Vidya that I was, I lost my charm, I lost my hope, I really felt the whole world is lost. In Kinudravan, the chance Varave, Varada, and Dalok, I became so depressed, I would say. I told Dr. Illa, Doctor, I don't think I'll be able to go further. No results are going to come. I became so vexed. I, I lost my hope. I lost my interest. Doctor very clearly said, 
it's not just IVF for anything that works with your first of all you need to have a good frame of mind first child if the irka idanala second one the madhi porandruma and the madhi would thought mind the work you should have a lot of positive thoughts and the madhi panina kandipa you will conceive normal green model the way like hope could come at the couple of the definitely you know I brought in a change in my own mind because me being a soft skills trainer on our daily hello corporates girl I go I train my corporate employees I felt the mother will cause all right over a number the follow-up and love being in a key I felt at the couple I developed a lot of positive thoughts I learned to you know control my feelings and have a lot of confidence in life and you know cool the not a cool I'm being the model confidence not going to one there really it happened at the couple of the everything was new everything was really wonderful the way I conceived at the couple of the check up on a man get up on the on game or a pace another she's more like a family member she knew my elder one in the elder son or achievements in the everything she would share she always said that second child nalla pora kuning kavle pora avinga you will be very glad about that baby he will be very he or she will be very cheerful in the expectations that you have about your second child epdi illa irukano ninga nenikringlo andha maari nadakkona nariya hope kudutanga and i think and the hope and the confidence on in a kaamcha and the interest adella seethu definitely i delivered a wonderful baby and in fact na delivery pandra time again that was a, a nice a miracle that happened actually because yenak avanga kudutha time ku vande ma'am ala vara mudiyala i had my labor very early adukulla ma'am was stuck in the traffic so i said i will not deliver because ma'am is not there but i had already gone into my labor and it is crucial that i have to deliver appo the doctors there in new hope they said ninga vari pannadinga there's one more doctor who will do the final thing but adukapra panna vendiya whatever uh, the stitching and those things adella vandu dr bhuneshri da vandu pannuvanga but idhe po ninga deliver panni aagano let somebody else do it for you na avanga romba kenji kootadi karasila vera or i still don't remember. remember her name which was a wonderful person very quick i delivered my second baby and she was so glad about my second baby because he was such a beautiful boy baby it la enna or expectation naanga vechirundona we wanted a girl but it was a boy so adu onnu da vande my mother in law and i we were like so sure we were it was a girl we made up our mind to be a girl and she said illa it's a boy so we couldn't believe it boy dana rendu thara na ketta adukapra ma'am vandu illa it's a boy it's a very beautiful boy abinanga adukapra i have been seeing her growing like uh, leaps and bounds she is really grown i would say and the chinna or place that she had at mukapair west she moved here near banyan that was a good news and every time that she opened a new complex or she started something new she'll always keep us posted i used to you know visit this place regular check up varum bodho ellame i have always seen her growing and i'm very glad that she has grown and in the infertility in or a or a concept which really is not very i mean at least today it is accepted but or a particular phase of time la vandu there are a lot of people who are against it they say it is against nature there are many things which are against nature but they don't become successful and the vishal i think ma'am or the determination and the intelligence that she has and i think yella the vida i know one thing about ma'am which i don't know many of them would have noticed or not she is a very very spiritual very religious person i think that is very important more than anything else science matto illama there is a lot of divinity that she has in treating patients i think that is a wonderful combination of divinity and science that is going together to make this happen and i wish her all the best and great success that she should open complexes and clinic and more of the hospitals in many other cities not only in chennai she should be known everywhere throughout india and maybe even you know in a international manner i think all the best to her and best wishes to gbr clinic thank you so much for giving me this opportunity thank you